Bye, Eivor. I'm so pleased. Make sure you look at my new designs. I would like... Until next time, Eivor! Use your tongue or I will feed it to you! Good day.
Where are these toy goats, child? Keep them safe elsewhere. My sister and I made them, and they are the finest in the land. I'm not sure about being the finest, but I do love them, every one. <laughs> if you have one in the likeness of Tankristnir, I will take it. Wow, thank you. I did it, sis. I sold one, I did it. What about my goat? Where are you going? to keep you warm sister this is your sister we made the goats together but the cold took her last winter i promised her i would continue selling our goats she said they can bring warmth into the hearts of others here it's yours i hope it will keep you warm on your travels goodbye nice stranger The legacy lives on with your sister.
official scroll stamp with a seal. Breeze, timber, food, wine. An expensive list of items to procure for a feast. Thank you, Audin. I will leave with these at once. Of course. A4, isn't it? What brings you to our archives? I've come to ask about these Christian texts. Luvina tells me the Red Hand is stealing them. Hmm, and destroying them? I fear they will attack these archives next. The Abbess here has offered to bring the texts somewhere safe. She's been working diligently on this matter. You flatter me, Lord. I only wish to help. Abbess Ingeborg, this is Eivor, our honored guest from the south. Eivor has offered to help rid Jorvik of the Red Hand. How can I help? An Abbess does not strike me as a suitable choice against a gang of ruthless bandits. It is my duty to protect the role of Christianity in our lives. Texts like this Gospel of Matthew were created for more than just perusing. They are a gift. They spread the word of God, and it is that which must be preserved, whatsoever the cost. I admire your resolve, but unless the Red Hand is dismantled, they will continue to harm those in possession of these texts. The Red Hand seems to know where to look for these texts. It may be someone is guiding them. What can you tell me? You know something else, that much is clear. The Abbess has her suspicions. As much as it pains me to say, I suspect something foul at the Rectory. I have heard whispering, collusion, and the Bishop. He has been sneaking around the Rectory, often visiting the priests in the cover of night. Time I pay these men of faith a visit. The Rectory is on the road to the Minster. I should look for the Bishop there. I have the Yuletide feast to prepare for as well. Uh, do drop by for the festivity. What happened to you, stranger? Burke, the man I work for, he did this to me, that evil man. I was simply doing a round of checks on our last shipment when he accused me of theft. Me! Theft! Please, bring me up to the bridge. I need some treatment, some medicine.
Poor Chad. About time you showed your face. What is left of it? Fuck. No, no, no. Get away from me. Come along, Chad. We still have work to do. Work? You still want me to work? I can't even see my own hands, you heartless bastard. He says you blinded him. Aye, that I did. What is a leader to do when his man can't take their eyes off his treasure, even after several warnings? I... I was not looking! You stabbed my eyes out! Quiet now, Chad. Um, hand him over to me. Do your best to follow me, Chad. Just kill me instead! I thought my fate was sealed. to the water or not. A moment oh, in frozen water is a minor cold. bit of suffering oh, for a nice. lifetime serving the Great Father. The bigger business. Do it. Mm. One does not receive the Holy Spirit under that the man needs eye a of push simply to improve trade. There you go. God! God! The ice waves are taking me! Uh, uh, save! Uh, oh! This is not so bad. Good God, at last. I hereby baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit within us all. You are now a child of God. Thank you for getting that man into the water. We had been waiting for too long. But we are patient. Anyone keen on the future? Oh! of mine taken this week. And with no... What do we have? Rob me of my house! To hell with it! Rob me of my wife! 
but I... What is this about God and pies? Someone stole my pie, and I, a skilled sniffer, am going to weed that pie thief out. All for a piece of pie. It is no ordinary pie. My pies top any other pies, and the blasted pie thief knows it. Oh, the smell. Oh, the smell. The thief went down this road. Come out, thief. I know you're here. I can smell my pie. The thief should not be far. I will find that scoundrel. Mmm, <gasps> fragrant of melted butter. Comforting. Warm. Aha! The thief came by. I am on the trail. My pie is near. My nose does not lie. Come out, thief! The coy sweetness of berries. I smell it. Oh, oh, oh. The thief must be near now. I recognize my pies are lords at any nose. Come out, come out. Mmm, the aroma of a pastry baked just right. The thief is near. Caught, scoundrel. Now, give my delicious pie back. Delicious? Your pie was blander than my late father's face. What did you put in my pie? <gasps> the smell, this aroma. It's never produced such an effect before. I added some honey. It'll enhance the berries by a bit. Good God. It does enhance the sweet smell. This is remarkable. Unheard of. A miracle. It seems like this child could make an extraordinary baker. And Jorvik could use one this thief. <sighs> well, it does smell spectacular. You have a keen sense for the culinary arts, child. You want a job? Hot piss of luck! Thank you so much, you won't regret it! I have so many ideas! <clears throat> Stop stealing the pies. Oh, thank you for your help. Come by my stall, should you have a craving for pie. Musky, been here long, priest? Just who do you think you are, trespassing like this? This is my property you've destroyed. I hear you priests have been hiding ever since some Christian texts went missing. What are you hiding from? The Red Hand? Who else? They muscle their way to and fro. No one has done a thing about it. I'm looking for the bishop. Where is he? Gone to his quarters. Said he would return once he finished tending to a private matter. But that was some time ago. Show me there. Wh what do you mean to do with him? Now. Lord, forgive me. Dominus autum of supplement. Liquidia domino. Signatra unis pia et pi sunt simna natura. Sed ic quod est naturae nisis deus manifestat arbitrium. The bishop's courses. What is this? Yeah. 
Bishop was conflicted and killed him before he could say a word. It's a confession. The bishop played a part in destroying these texts against his own will. The rest of the letter is burnt, but makes mention of the minster and the abbess. His ambush has been keeping these texts. Look around! Search every room! They're around here somewhere! It's them! It's the Red Hand! Oh, Lord of mercy! Quiet. The Red Hand, I need to leave. Stretch your wings sooner. The target sent the red hand after me. It must be closing in. It's time I enter the minster. The abyss knows more than she's letting on.
I should not be seen in this area. What? Just what do you think you're doing? This is no place for you, priest. Go. Now. Blasphemy! Stop this at once! Something troubling you, father? Abbess, look. They are burning all of these passages. Why are you not stopping this? Because I ordered them to. What? The vellum that burn before you are covered in lies. So long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. Lies? Abbas, what has happened to you? We are God's children all. Do not renounce him like this. Please, I beg of you. You can still repent. God will forgive you. You know he will. Your mind has been poisoned, but worry not. We have the antidote. We will set a new example to which all may aspire. You, you, you're mad. You won't get away with this. I won't let you. No one to tell. No one who will hear you cries. If you cannot bear to watch them burn, then you should burn with them. I want it all destroyed. Every text, every passage, every scribbled piece of paper, everything. It is time to end this. Yes, Firebrand. Buy a bread. She'll kill whoever stands in her way. Time I get between her and the next bit. <laughs> this fire that burns it. I've always had it, a longing to do something grand and important. But that door was always shut to me. My methods deemed too severe. I was cast out, shunned, scorned. But the Order, they took notice of me, saw that it was courage that drove me. Courage to change the world for the better. They reopened that door. And you used your chance to destroy a way of life you did not support. We have seen time and time again what happens when people are left to interpret for themselves. Knowledge must be controlled. Only then can the message be widely understood. The day where there is but one truth draws nearer. One truth, that is what the Order offers. This one sought to spark a new flame, but did so with a heavy hand, not a teacher's tongue. This cleansing of yours ends here. My work is incomplete, but not inconsequential. There are others who carry on, for one of the four is us. Why did you say that? What does it mean? Now I go. A flame that grows bright and burns ever more, ever light. To Helheim, where colder and crueler fires await. Hang on! You die! Odin owns you! You'll crawl soon enough!
below with your body so wee? Do you think that you'll ever be up here like me? Will you fly against me and try testing your luck? I accept. And like lightning will leave you dumbstruck. Not bad. But what will you wager? Here's my bet. Now do your worst. I call down from on high the full strength of the gods to defeat all the stammerers, weaklings and frauds. And those men who approach, I make fools of them all. I call down from on high. The one fool I see here is up on that wall. Not bad, I suppose. I am here in the clouds while you crawl on the ground like a sad little worm making a pitiful sound. And my height goes to show how above you I stand. Then enjoy while you can, a great fall is at hand. Surprisingly competent. I have every advantage I see for an age. My words are my weapons, these ramparts my stage. What's it like being tiny, an ant in the loam? What's it like feigning hugeness? You're not but a gnome. That one landed. Well, for a mere speck of a flighter, you're surprisingly strong. You've earned your winnings. You're a mighty little midge. Better luck next time! Fancy a game of all? Or love. Let's. Interesting.
That is... What news do you bring? The firebrand's flame burns no longer. It was Jorvik's abbess, Inkiborg. Gods, I would never have suspected. Does the orders reach no no bounds? None, and it is often those we least expect who carry out their ambitions. The abbess sought to destroy all Christian texts in the city, rid Jorvik of their ideals. She did utter a phrase that perked my ears. One of the four is ours. Four? But there are only three targets in Jorvik. Could there be something we're missing? Damn Picts! Not only do they hold the North, but those lawless chicks have free roam in our lands as well. Yours said our spies are on the ground. Under the ground. Only one of them has returned, bone beaten and bloodied. The howling mother takes them. Lovina, a moment of your time. And here if he's about. I will be with you shortly. Two more left to hunt. The disputes coming out of the docks lately have been deafening. Head there and dig around. Something is bound to turn up. <laughs> 